What's up, family? I bet you didn't see this one coming. Disney has introduced its first boy princess. Let me say that again. Disney, the channel you grew up with, that good, wholesome channel that your parents could turn on and leave the room and not be too concerned with you coming across anything inappropriate, has introduced its first boy princess. How did we get here? In a recent episode of the Disney XD Channel animated series, Star vs. the Forces of Evil, the character Marco Diaz transforms himself into Princess Marco Tardina for his visit to the St. Olga's Reform School for Wayward Princesses, where he is to be given an honorary degree. However, before Marco is able to confess that he is pretending to be a princess, the school's evil head mistress, Miss Haynes, outs him as a boy by exposing his single curly hair that is hidden underneath his purple gown. So, some people will say that, okay, people are overreacting. This is blown out of proportion. This is just a boy pretending to be a girl so that he could access the school to help his friend out. Typically, one may think something like that. When I was a youngster, I would have thought that. But I realized as Hollywood pushes this gay agenda that no, it's something behind that. It's propaganda. Yes, this is an old story. Men have dressed like women often in movies and animated shows and stuff like that. We've seen that happen. And sometimes women have switched genders to gain access. It's a common theme. But now... In today's climate, you got to hold Hollywood's feet to the fire because they have an agenda. And to me, this is propaganda. The, uh, this is what they'll do. They'll start off by doing something like this where you got the guy, you got this guy pretending to be a princess. Next thing you know, the guy really is a princess and they got a whole story based around it. It's a spinoff story. That's the game. And you got to pay close attention. You got to pay very close attention to how they get down. One of the most effective ways to get people to support an idea, especially if that idea is controversial or goes against societal norms, is to put it in the context of a joke. They won't even know what hit them. They'll just be living a life like it's golden. I'll say this and go. I've never been a fan of dudes who dress like women. I've never been a fan of women who dress up like men. I'm cool with women being women and men being men. If you choose to have a certain lifestyle, man, go and do your thing. But leave these children alone. No more talk. What the ladies talking about?